Hello, my name is John Kassar and I'm the director, executive producer here on 24. First, I'd like to thank you for buying the Season 5 DVD set. By doing this, you now have exclusive access to this behind-the-scenes video diary. You get to share in the secrets of the making of 24 in 18 installments throughout the broadcast of Year 6. Right here, you'll be able to see interviews and exclusive footage not seen anywhere else but on this website. You get specialized tours of wardrobe, need a belt, the prop lockup, which is floor to ceiling filled with props, like this one here, for example. You'll have to watch out for this in future episodes. And this set behind me, which I can't really show you in any detail right now, but in a future installment, production designer Joseph Hodges will take you on a personalized tour and show you why it's a very important set on season six of 24. And I thought I'd kick off the first installment with a director's tour of CTU. So let's start with Chloe's area. Chloe. Hi, Kim. You're still here. Even though she's right in the middle where everyone can hear almost every conversation she has, we still play, play conversations like they're private. And we're just able to do that by just keeping the shots very tight, right on her face, and you just assume that no one else can hear what she's saying, even though here she is right in the middle of everything. Yeah. I trusted you. Only because he had to, I helped stage his death. The hub of the activity in CTU is always in the bullpen. This is what we call the area where all the other programmers are. Did you get him? Still working on it. It's designed in a way that we can get the cameras right around it. It's an oval. It's a big oval that I can put all the cameras around and really shoot inside. So when there's a scene where they're monitoring things and things are happening at CTU and it's all very exciting, the cameras stay on the outside and can look inside. Now we're in the deep, dark basement of CTU. If you come with me, you'll see that it's right in CTU. But the way we shoot it, by always putting our cameras towards it, just like my camera's doing now, it always feels like it's in the dungeon. From now on, when you're in CTU, take a look and see in the background and see if you can see these servers that are actually in plain sight. It's all just a trick. On 24, we always need to move people from A to B because we're in real time, which means a lot of the time we have to move people down hallways. With natural gas. You can use it as a delivery system. Let's say talks, you can get it into people's homes. I need you to get Chloe on it. We need to find out which one. Right. We don't have that many hallways here on the set, but we can do it in a way where we go down one hallway, that becomes another hallway. And so really we only have two long hallways which we keep using and reusing. A swing set is a set that you can make anything you want. So in 24, at CTU, we always need swing sets. What you'll probably recognize this as right away, because it's round, is that this is where we do all of our medical. Do you remember me? My name is Tony Almeida. You killed my wife, Michelle Destin, this morning. You can see here, in an upcoming episode, we need it as a morgue. I can't tell you much more about that. You're going to have to wait and watch the show. Hope you enjoyed the first installment of the 24 Video Diary. And remember, after every episode, come back to this website for your exclusive look at how we made that show. Thank you again for buying the DVD set.